Hi, this is Mike Benton for AllShadow.com, and today I'm going to show you how to play old school Nintendo on Windows Mobile. Okay, first things first, sync up your Windows Mobile device, and once that's done, go to mobile.surrealnetworks.com on your PC or Windows Mobile phone. Now, there's three versions of Pocket Nester Plus, which is what we're downloading. The one for SDA, I'm just going to show it to you. You don't need this one. This is for an older phone. Uh, look at the size and make sure you don't download that one. Now for the Shadow or the Dash or any other non-touchscreen smartphone, you're going to want to go to Applications for Dash and download the Pocket Nester Plus that's under there. It's 508 kilobytes, so make sure you get that one. Load that to your desktop. Now for touchscreen devices, like the, the Diamond, you want to go to Applications for MDA and download the one called Pocket Nester. It's about 315 kilobytes. Now once you got that downloaded, go to File Management and transfer it to your directly your My Documents folder. Now once you have that downloaded, install it. And one of the first things you're going to want to do is go to, after it's installed, go to Start. Pocket Nester Plus, if you don't see it there, go to the Games folder and then go to Options Controllers and you're going to want to assign the keys on your keypad. Now for the A and B buttons on the Shadow, I use the 9 key. For the up, down, left and right, I use the 1, the question mark, the 4, and the 5. For Select and Start, I use the 3 key and the OP key. And be sure to assign your menu key, which I've assigned to Alt and now you're ready to go. I've already installed my ROMs onto my storage card so let's just get a game going and we'll show you a few, show you how it works. I hope you enjoyed this short tutorial, and until next time, I am Mike Benton for AllShadow.com.